this is the duo cam column wear plate bullet bolting system. It's a fastening system. There's several components to it that I'm going to explain to you. First, we have the locking fastener. This is a proprietary lock nut that resists uh, vibration loosening and withstands the rigors of the railway industry, specially designed for this application. We also have a special bolt. It's called a tension control bolt. It's, it's countersunk so that it fits nicely in the column wear plate. It's recessed. The bolt has a spline on the end. This spline will shear off during installation and that's what guarantees you have the proper clamp load in the column wear plate joint to meet AAR standards. We also have a special installation tool. This is the only tool that can perform this installation and the important aspect of this tool is the dual socket system. We have an inner socket and an outer socket. The inner socket is meant to engage the spline of the bolt. The outer socket is meant to engage the nut itself. So we've already applied a we've already applied a column wear plate finger tightened on this side frame. The bolts are just finger tight. They haven't been fully tightened and installed on the uh, with the wrench. We did install the lower bolt, but we left the, the upper bolt to be installed. So we're just going to demonstrate how the wrench engages the fastener. Got to make sure that both the inner socket and outer socket are engaged on the nut. It takes can take some playing around. And then we just pull the trigger. What you'll see is when the installation is complete, the spline of the bolt shears off. That means the installation is complete. You'll also notice that the wrench is an electric wrench and it's non-impacting. It operates very smoothly and is very easy to use. If you're a QA inspector, it's extremely easy to inspect that everything has been installed properly. As long as you see the splines of the bolts have been sheared off, you know the installation has been complete. If you see the spline on a bolt still on there, the installation has not been completed.